All right, so this is going to be how to grind cash quickly in Dawn of Aurora. So you're gonna want to choose not fear, but outsider when you join. So this is gonna be the criminal method, not like doing anything complicated. So uh, I'm assuming this is you've already started mostly. So get in here, hop. In. And you can take any of these paths. I don't really care. I don't care which one. I just drive this way. I, was, I think it's this way. Yeah, it's this way. So what you're going to want to do, you're going to have to have certain items. Uh, you need uncommon C4, common hacking devices, common C4, and uncommon hacking devices right here, which is kind of optional. So, uh, if you aren't aware how to get those items, uh, I will show you. So, you'll just pop in right over here. Oh. Ah! I don't like this area. Okay, so you'll pop in right over here. And... Uh... I'm, I'm a great driver, if you weren't aware. Oh yeah, high quality vines. So you'll talk to this dude. There's multiple of these guys around the map. They're named Black Jap, and they sell things in the black market. So, let's buy things from them. This isn't too expensive, 500. Purchase one of those. Purchase some extra common C4. You can get these, they're just slightly faster. I don't recommend, at all. But I just get them anyway, just because it's cool to see. Uh, you should also have like a few weapons on you, and then some food. If you like them, use speed potions. They are very worth it for the money. And if you want to you know how to get those, you go over to this. Oh yeah, I'm a great driver. So you, I'm just gonna take my car. If you aren't aware of how to get these cars, they're kind of easy, but if you're not using this method, they're extremely hard. So you can get. Like speed potions here. They're pretty efficient, I guess. Yeah. Okay. Let me spawn my car. So you're gonna wanna go to Bank Aurora, so it spawns all the way over here. It's currently being raided. So as you can see, the raid requirements are that and that. This isn't really required, it just says so. You need a common one, actually. You only need that one if you want to save the lasers, which I will get more onto laser. Later. Ha, ah, laser. Uh, funny, funny joke, joke. Close chat. Chat is retarded. Where am I going? Who this boy? L, too slow. Okay, well, I'm getting lost. And I'm also a good driver. Uh-huh, yep. Yes, sir. Yeah, he's gonna catch up to me. Or not. Let's start with... I'm so bad at navigation. Oh, it's the nuclear swamp. Yes, this way. See, I took the long way around. It's the scenic route. Not that I didn't know which way to go. Uh huh. Nope. Totally. I took the scenic route, guys. Dude, ah. Okay. Looking your way downtown into here. So I'm gonna use. Common hack device for this one. Those are pretty cheap, like 250 or 500 each, don't remember. So I'm just gonna pop and jump up right around here. And poop! Okay, it's gone. Right now I'm not a criminal, but I will become a criminal. Wait, that, is that a criminal right there? That's nice. Yeah, so if you want to become a criminal, I can show you a different way. That's much easier getting in. You don't need any hacking devices. Much simpler. 
I know I'm poor, like really poor, but doing this, you can get so much insanely fast. Oh, this guy is really taking a lot of people down. Okay, so you're just gonna pop over here. It's kind of above right here, so it's kind of dangerous because the fear do spawn right over there, but I think it's worth it. So you just hack. This will put, make you a criminal and make you wanted, as you can see, and you will see like where who to evade, but it's pretty easy after that. So you just hack, so then you grab your car. If you don't already have a car, then this is going to be slightly harder. So you just pop in here, and then you just drive off from here. Yeah, zero crashes. And I'm going to take this car. You don't actually have to store your vehicle every time. I just prefer it because so I had an incident with this car where people just shot my car a lot. So I prefer to store it. So someone doesn't come along and feels like, hey, I'm going to be annoying and do things legal. So, uh, oh yeah. So I should probably show you, if you didn't get the required materials to rob the bank from there yet. And I'll show you how to get... There's another supplier. Another blackjack. So, yeah. I kind of went to the bank first. I'm just going to want to vibe this way. You make your way downtown. So you, you probably saw this right here. Black market sells raiding equipment. Now, it's kind of hard to find this if you aren't... If you don't know exactly where it is. It's kind of hidden. Like, so currently... It would seem like, hey, I'm right here. Where is it? It's not here. See, that's why you go into here. And it's kind of hidden. You have to go down here. And I take, nope, not not a left. Yep, see? Smart, smartness. You take a right. Take another right. And you pop right over here. And you're in the criminal depot. This is a safe zone in the city. This, if you die in the city, this is where you will spawn, and then you talk to this dude. He doesn't have as much stuff right now. Well, he does He does not have anything right now. That's nice. And then this guy, he gives you food. It's not that great. Burgers, best food. 20 health, and that decent amount of energy. Only problem, they don't stack very much. It's only 3 per stack. And it fills up your inventory fast. So I just suggest taking one stack and then some Bloxy Colas. Because Bloxy Cole is better for the stack value. Okay, so now let me show you the bank. It's probably going to be closed right now because there's a lot of other criminals. So, the bank is only open every 5 minutes or 3 minutes, I'm not actually sure. And you get a decent amount of money from it. Like, a really amount, good amount of money. Right now I'm using one of the free cars, but you can get this car in like about 5 robberies of this. So it's right here. So you can enter through here. He has a bank of Aurora. Or my preferred way is you go through the back. You wait over here. See, so if you go that way, you have to go all the way around walking. But if you go this way, you basically are already here. Because, oh, it's open. Look at that. See how long it's open for. Oh, it's open just in general. That's nice. So you just walk in. If it's not open, this thing will be red. You can't go through. Only cops can go through. So you're going to be aware of camping cops who ride around corners and stuff. So what you'll do... So I'm going to consume one of these. Because it's just helpful. Here we take... Common hacking device. So you can use a common hacking device. You can use anything better. This is going to get me wanted. So if you don't want to be wanted, then you just don't do this. Let someone else do it. So you're gonna break in, and I think, yep, yeah, I got my bounty up. So you're gonna dodge the lasers. I suggest not sprinting like I just did, because it'll ruin your stamina. Ouch. So I took damage. Yeah, I'm a pro, I know. So skilled. So here is the optional thing. So you can disable all lasers with an uncommon hacking device. This one. But here's the thing. The fear members that will come in here, they can just walk straight through. So when a fear member is going to try to read, I suggest not turning it off. But if you don't want to struggle with that, the lasers everywhere, and you're like a bit more scared of lasers than actual players, turn it off while you want. It's not that much of a cost. So that man, he took 
but I was going to show you, but that's alright. So what you'll need for right here is this vault door. You will need two uncommon C4. I can stack that right there. So right now I have five. It's pretty cheap. And then you get in, and you pop over here, and just collect money. And the cap is 10,000. And it's not like jailbreak, where when you walk out, you just collect the money. No, no, it's harder than that. So I'm just going to collect the money. And there will be cops that come down from right there. And they will try to shoot you. So I suggest having like a, a decent assault rifle. Not like the starter weapons. Or the one that the group gives you. So yeah, there's there's a cop right there. Uh, almost full. Okay, so there's a cop right up there. 204 away. Yeah, so he placed it. You need a common C4 for this one. It doesn't have to be uncommon. So you pop right out here. Run as fast as you can. My speed already wore off. And then you'll want to spawn a car. You can either spawn a car. Or you can get into this rare alba right here. And the rare alba is pretty decent. Decently fast. Better than like a junker or whatever. And oh yeah. So you're going to run away. See see if I triangles. Their stars kind of from GTA. It's ripped off from that. So once that drops down to no stars, you, they won't be able to track you down anymore, and you can't go into the cr into the criminal base until you have no stars. So you just drive around for a bit. I suggest like going to a s hidden spot. There's multiple hidden spots. Not really hidden, just like secluded. The car wouldn't really drive past here. That's that's a glitch. That's not a hidden spot. No, don't go in there. Suggestions. So this is kind of hidden. No one would really come, like, drive by and like, look over here for you. And it's already almost gone. So, you can get more of these if you, like, do everything yourself. Because it gives more. And boom, I just got 10,000 from that. It's insane quick money. And then, you can just look at map now. And... It's, it's close for five minutes, and then you can just do that over and over. And then once you have your money... Oh, that's a cop right there. Here, bro. Gotta reload. Hi, guy. My guy, what do you expect? Alright. So, yeah. We just drive back to the crim base I feel like they should add one of these things like to show you where the crim base is at all times so you don't have to drive there and like do annoying things so let's look on the map every once in a while it kind of helps you drive. oh yes sir server lag is amazing Oop. Oh, yes, sir. Pop around right here. And there's another one of the rare albums that spawns right there. And you're in. And you basically have everything needed. You can talk to this dude again. He has more in stock. Purchase more, I guess. But aside from that, that's pretty much it. Uh, thank you for watching. And I can show you more in a future video like if you enjoy this if you need more tutorials like this subscribe and yeah peace